how do you create an expensive looking outfit without an expensive price tag? Well, one way you can do it is by using colour and combining the right colour combinations together. In this video, I'm going to share with you five classic colour combinations that when you pair them together can make your outfit look much more expensive than it is. The first colour combination is navy with brown and it could be any shade of brown, a really beautiful deep rich chocolate brown or perhaps a chestnut brown or even a camel. So hopefully you'll be able to find a shade of brown that suits you that you can make this colour combination work with navy. There's many different variations and ways to wear this combination. So I went through my cupboards to see what I've got in the two colours and what I could put together. And I've managed to put seven outfit combinations initially with what I've got. The first is navy trousers with a navy sweater. And to that I've added a brown belt and a camel coat. Now a variation of that is with a brown or a camel shirt with the same trousers and again with the camel coat. Instead of the coat, I could wear the same blouse, but with a camel blazer this time. I do actually have a brown cardigan and a matching sweater. So I've tried mixing them around with either a navy top underneath and with the trousers and also with the sweater. I could wear the camel blouse with a navy blazer. It's a smart outfit that could work for business meetings. I could wear all navy but just accessorise it with a brown tote bag and the brown belt. Or when it's colder I could wear all navy with a camel coat and a camel scarf. Now that's just a few outfits that I've been able to put together with what I already have but there's so many other options that you may be able to piece together with what you have. You may have some brown trousers that you could wear with, with navy on top, maybe a navy sweater and a coat or with a brown skirt and brown knee-high boots. It could be an all navy outfit with brown boots and bag, or if you have a navy dress, it could be paired with a brown coat and bag. You can see there's so many ways to make this combination work and how lovely it can look together. Sometimes the simplest colors together can look the most polished, like green and black, for example. Two basic colors, but when they're paired together can look terrific. This combination can be made to work for smarter looks or more casual day-to-day -day outfits. A long line olive or khaki green coat really looks wonderful worn very simply with all black underneath. The Princess of Wales has worn this look before and she's also done it with a matching green sweater with black on the bottom. And the same outfit could be worn with a green blazer and you could add a really gorgeous printed scarf to that. It can look fantastic. Now if you work in an office, the pairing could be worn together with a green suit and black accessories, or it looks terrific worn as a skirt and top combination. There's just these two colours in these outfits, but even though it's very simple together, they complement each other so well. Now these looks are quite smart looks, but the pairing could be worn much more casually. You could wear all black with a green casual jacket. It could be a utilitarian style jacket or even a bomber jacket. And the combination could be reversed for a casual look with green on the bottom and black on the top. One of my favourite colour combinations at this time of year is camel worn with red. These two together can look really luxurious. There's so many different ways and variations that you can wear the pairing that even if camel doesn't suit you, you could still wear it. Instead of wearing camel close to your face, wear it on the bottom with the red closest to your skin. So you could wear a red blouse or sweater or whatever you have with camel on the bottom. If you have a red dress, it can look wonderful warm with a camel coat and tan boots. It's really stunning together. Now you could try red trousers and a camel coat. It does look great, but red trousers aren't something that everyone has in the wardrobe. So an easier formula is wearing camel with red shoes or a red bag. Or you could even reverse it with a red coat and camel bag. It's not a combination you see that often but it looks just as lovely. You could always add some black and blue as well to the combination. Burgundy is such a beautiful rich colour and it looks wonderful in the autumn and the winter. Now just like navy it can be really versatile and it goes with lots of other colours so it was quite difficult to just pick one colour to combine it with in this video. But what I decided on was burgundy worn with black or navy. 
Try pairing a two-piece sweater and cardigan together with some wide leg trousers with a statement belt and a beautiful bag. It's nice and easy to buy those pieces, but it could be things you already have that you could play around with to make different outfit combinations. You don't see burgundy trousers that often, but if you have some, you could always try pairing them with a burgundy top and add in a black bag and some black shoes of some kind. Now I love this top to toe burgundy outfit. Adding a black bag to this would complete the outfit beautifully. Another combination instead of a dress would be some faux leather burgundy trousers, which could be put together with a burgundy shirt and a black bag. And you could wear either a black or burgundy coat with that. And this look could also be reversed with black faux leather trousers and worn with boots. I've got a whole video on the colours that pair with burgundy, so if you're looking for more options, I will link that above. And I also have a Pinterest board dedicated to burgundy, which I'll link below for you. This is a colour combination that I've truly grown to love over time. It's grey worn with camel. These two together complement each other so nicely. Now, just like the red and camel colour combination, there's so many different ways that these two can be paired together. So I raided my wardrobe to see what I could put together in this colour combination. I've got some grey sort of formal trousers which I've put together with a camel silk shirt and a camel blazer. Now because of the style of the trousers I've added some heels to this look. I have put a belt with it which is grey. I thought that blended and balanced the outfit much more than a brown one would. I have tried layering this look with my camel coat. I just put it over my shoulders for now, but obviously I could take the blazer off and just wear the coat. For bags, I tried it with the tan tote bag, but I could swap everything around for a gray bag and a gray coat would also work. Now in my wardrobe, I've got a gray jump. So I swapped that with the blouse and put all gray underneath and I've kept the camel coat and the bag, but I've switched the shoes for some trainers just to keep the outfit just a little bit more relaxed. When it gets cold, I could either add a camel scarf or a grey scarf, both would work. Also to this look, I've tried my mulberry tan shoulder bag instead of the tote bag. Something else I have in my wardrobe grey is a cardigan and a matching jumper. So I've tried that with all grey underneath and just added a tan bag. Like this look here, I could add a camel coat over the top. It's really just about piecing together what you have in those colours to make lots of different outfits. Now I haven't included any beige or winter white outfits in this video, but they can look incredible in the colder months. You may find this video interesting to watch next if you want to elevate your autumn and winter wardrobes.